Hey guys, what's up? Another review. This one is a bit late, but uh, I love the first issue, did a review of it, and finally got a chance to read the second one. So I'm going to do it, even though it's like almost a month late. But I'm caught up. I just read, well, it's Winter Soldier, number two. And uh, I've read the second and third one, so I'll have a review up of the third one pretty soon after this one. May I just say, the cover to all the Winter Soldiers so far have been awesome. And, uh, yeah, if you want to know what Winter Soldier is and you don't know, it's B Bucky Barnes and Black Widow chasing down uh, sleeper agents, basically. At least what this series is about so far. Huge Winter Soldier history. Different story, different video altogether. But anyway, this one picks up right after the first one. The first one ended, of course, with the, spoiler alert, gorilla with the gun screaming death to America, I believe. Awesome right there, right? Well, you think that's awesome? That gorilla gets a jetpack. That right there should be enough for you to buy this book. Do I really have to say more? I will, but I don't have to. You already want the book. It's got a gorilla with a jetpack. Who doesn't want that? <laughs> I'm sorry. Anyway, this book is really good. Content the first one I love, this one I love too. I'm gonna give this one an eight point five out of ten. Very solid, continuing the story, moving it forward at a very good pace. It's very Ed Brubaker, of course, and it combines his love that everyone knows, his love of uh, noir and crime, and crime uh, novels and comics and ideas. Combines those with the superhero elements and the crazy Marvel Universe elements. And this one ends with another cliffhanger that's pretty cool. And... Also, of course, throughout this, you're dealing with the the Victor Von Doom. He, uh, one of the sleeper agents, awakes, tries to kill Doom. Dumb idea, but it makes sense as you read it. And third issue will deal a lot more with Doom. So yeah, this one, a quick, really quick review, but it's late. Sorry. Uh, yeah, 8.5 out of 10. See you guys in another review.